Karibuni sana bitchy by Kangai. Hoop hoop. And I'm very excited to be here with you guys today. Um, today I'm not gonna be doing my makeup look with you guys. Mm -hmm. mm. I did my makeup. Um, I decided today I just wanna sit down and just talk with you guys. Um, the video might not be that long, but yeah. Um, so. This is a makeup look that I did today and I'm hoping to do this makeup look with you guys um, in my next vlog. But anyway, so I'm here today so that I could talk about um, makeup and um, not just makeup but it's my makeup journey. Like how far or when did I start my makeup and what has been my journey. So that is what I am here to share with you guys today. So I really hope you enjoy this video and I really hope that you get um, inspired by anything that I say. Um, and I'll say it again and I'll say that I am not perfect at it. We all just learn and each and every day is a learning day, right? So each and every day is a learning day. I am not perfect. As I sit here and I do makeup with you guys and show you, it doesn't mean that I am perfect. Um, it doesn't mean that I'm perfect, but each and every day is a learning day. And, um, yeah. So, where do I start? But before that, as I said, I really hope that you enjoy this video. And honest, I began makeup when I was very, very young. I could actually say even before class one, I was doing makeup. But at that time, my makeup didn't make sense. Because, guys, you can't believe what I was using as my makeup. I was literally using the paint guys this paints that we when you wine pp1 pp2 pp3 yeah the paint you would buy and then you would paint on your on your papers and draw things and paint them that is what i was using can you imagine and i'll just do it and uh, i wish i had pictures i looked for them but i wasn't able to find them but i know i had pictures when i had applied paint as my makeup but yes that is how i started and then later on when I got to class 2, I have an auntie of mine who actually bought for me my first makeup kit. She's very special to me. She's very lovely. So yeah, she bought for me my first makeup kit. And now from there, I ended up, you know, continuing with makeup and teaching myself how to do makeup. And um, yeah, it, it, wasn't, it wasn't easy, you know, because now at that time your parents are like, why are you doing makeup, you know? You're still too young. What is it for me? But you, you're just like, okay. Um, let's say just me. I was just like, okay. So I'll just sit in the house and I'm bored. I do it. I just look at myself. I find myself. Because at that time, I didn't have a phone I to take pictures or anything. Yeah. So I continued like that. And then when I got to, when I was in primary, when I got to class six, I went to a boarding school. So you know boarding. You're given pocket money, right? So for me, my pocket money was not for snacks. My pocket money, I used to make sure that I am saving to buy myself new lipsticks or a pencil and stuff like that. And that time, pocket money, I don't know. Yeah, I don't know. My pocket money wasn't really that much though. Just like 500. So, you know, you save. So I, I continued like that. I continued saving. I'll buy myself my lipsticks. Um, I pencil because that was the makeup of those days, you know, and I'll do my pencil sometimes in school on Saturdays, Sunday, like that. So I'll do my pencil and then lipstick, you know, lipstick you do it in your magic. But during the events of school, yeah, um, I would do lipstick, yeah. So mm, I continued like that. I continued saving by myself new lipstick shades. Um, I I pencil black, you know, and then you'll do it in the eye, you know. So that's how I, I continued until I got to high school. So now when I got to high school, by that time, even now, makeup products were, were getting more and more, you know. So now I got I got an eyeshadow palette. Um, so I used to try to do my eyeshadow, you know, and um. I used to try to my shadow, I do lipstick, and you know, I continued like that, you know, but it wasn't, um, it wasn't something, I can't say makeup is hard, it just, I would actually say makeup is, um, what can I, 
it's just it's like an art yeah and i'll honestly say you know people are like ah oh. some people will be like oh me you know but if you are really really interested and if that is what you love you know you'll never get tired you'll always want to learn learn and learn and then again as i always say or as i said in my other videos that patience is a virtue patience is a virtue so if you need to be patient you know so if you're patient things just things end up going on um you end up continuing to learn even no matter how hard it is patience just be patient learn slowly and stuff like that so back to my story so at this time i'm in high school then um after high school um now university yeah so when i finished high school i didn't at the at the stay home for a while like i finished and then entered high school then university i finished high school then entered university the next year yeah in january so i started university so now at university now i had all the the freedom yeah i could apply makeup at any time because like, in high school you can't apply makeup at a every day at a lipstick for me but anyway yeah so now i'll do my lipstick i'll do my eye pencil and my mascara yeah so and then i'll go and i'll i'll go to school you know and um now from there i started doing my eyeshadow in university nicely not perfect like i don't know if right now i'm perfect but yeah so just teaching myself just watching youtube videos you know um i did it i i moved to eyeshadow and then i remember actually on my it was my 18th birthday my friends actually bought me an eyeshadow palette and i was really really happy so happy because friends who know that makeup is my bae makeup is my bae you know so so happy and i was like oh thank you you know i was happy it's makeup i love makeup what yeah so um in university that's how i continued and then slowly by slowly even after after watching youtube videos and seeing how people do it you know i'm like i also want to to learn you know i always i always wanted how to learn to do my makeup well you know at far at first i'll do and i'll sit in the house and i'm like is this worth really coming out to and then people looking at you yeah so i continued like that um that i continued like that in university so now in university is when my whole thing started opening up you know um yeah i'm still in uni though but now in university you know now the the knowing how to do eyebrows came up and let me tell you guys wah 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 eyebrows you can look at my eyebrows yeah they are not i can't say like right now my eyebrows are perfect as you can see yeah eyebrows are a struggle they were my biggest struggle i don't know i I struggled with them. Like I would do it, I would sit in the house and look at myself and I'm like, is this really what I'm coming out with? You know? And then um I kept on telling my big sister, I want to learn how to do eyebrows, you know. I want to learn how to do them. And uh, she would send me videos to watch. Even I shadow, I remember she used to send me videos. And my sister my big sister was very, very she's very, very supportive, you know. And she'll send me videos and tell me watch, see, then try, then show me how you've done, you know. And then she'll be like, okay, so next time do it like this, like that, you know. And follow this video nicely, just take your time. So she did that for me with eyeshadow, then we moved to eyebrows also. Um, so we did eyebrows and eyebrows were, wow. hey, my God, let me just take my water. <laughs> eyebrows were a struggle my friends it was a struggle i struggled with eyebrows i struggled with eyebrows so when i started my i don't know i did they didn't have i just don't know they were really a struggle so every single time i still will do a video of her doing her eyebrows and then she'll show me she'll do a video she'll show me you know so she did a video for me and she showed me and then she'll send me links to watch how people are doing their eyebrows and i'll just follow by the end of it all i was like um so long as they don't look bad you know so long as they don't cause attention for people to be looking at you like wow wow what's the problem you know so long as they don't cause attention and you're comfortable with it then that's fine 
So for me, I always try to do something very natural. I don't know really doing something natural. Like try and make it natural as possible. Like that that is for me, you know, but everyone is different. Um so at the end of it all I was like, so this is how I'm gonna be doing them. And it's still hard because each and every day I still watch videos until now and I still teach myself how to do it, how to do them. Um yeah. So after that I and you can imagine I have been teaching myself. Yeah, apart from my big sister helping me, it's just been me and her. Her showing me videos and me doing the videos and just practicing, you know. So I've been doing it by myself. I have, I moved. Yeah, so at the end of it all, guys, if, if you're really, I would actually say, if you're really, really, really interested in something, then the best, the, I don't know how many words I'm going to tell you. First of all, focus. Focus. No matter no matter what comes your way, don't don't let distractions come to your way. If you're really focused on something, I was focused on makeup and I wanted to grow. I wanted to grow in my makeup. I wanted to to do nice looks. You know, the first thing you do is focus. Don't don't let anything distract you. Yeah, and by distractions, I'm talking about people who are very negative about it. You know, at the ah, don't do makeup. At the and then um and you're like okay <laughs> yeah don't you just focus on your path you know i want to do makeup i want to learn how to do it and i want to be natural at it focus focus don't don't let distractions come your way and second there's nothing that comes easy and we all know that right nothing in this life comes easy we all struggle to get somewhere you know we all struggle so even as we struggle i want us to remember or i want you guys to remember that patience is a virtue patience is a virtue always be patient you know when you do your eyebrows and you don't it doesn't come out be patient tomorrow wake up sharpen the eye pencil and let's try it again Patience is a virtue. And always, always practice. Always be ready and happy to practice, you know. So, focus, patience, always practice, and stay positive. Stay positive, you know. And lastly, believe in yourself. You can't, you can't do something and you don't believe in yourself. We all know that. Like, like there's no way um, you'll say, I want to be a journalist yeah but you don't believe in yourself like you know very well if you stand in front there you start to shiver <laughs> I don't know if I've made sense there but you can't do something if you don't believe if you don't believe you know so believe in yourself and trust in yourself and keep on telling yourself that you can do it I remember for me it, it it's still not easy yeah like it's still not easy until today but I still tell myself Tina we're gonna make it we're gonna grow beauty by Kangai. Beauty by Kangai is gonna it's gonna grow and we're gonna make it, yeah? So always believe in yourself and always give yourself your motivation. Okay. Um discouragements come, just let them enter and come out. Like don't keep them in your mind because you'll never grow what you want to grow, yeah? And especially if it's makeup, yeah. And also be close to the people who encourage you the most. For me, my big sister encouraged me. She's worked with me. Till today, she still works with me. So, that is someone who you should, you know, be close with and work with. I, I have an auntie of mine. She is the most awesome person. She's the most awesome person. She will come home and she's like, I'm going for a wedding. Could you do my makeup? And I'm like, okay. And I'll just practice with her. And at the end of it all, I'll do something nice. And she's like, oh, this is nice. You know me. And she'll encourage me. And at some point, she'll even buy for me products. And, you know, and sit with the people who encourage you. Stay strong with the people who encourage you. Like, don't let, don't let um, three people who are discouraging you win the one person who is encouraging you. I don't know if I have made sense, but... I hope you have understood, yeah. Um, so that that my story, me starting from primary or PP one with paints, you know, and growing till today. So that is my makeup story. Um, yeah.
<laughs> anyway, that's not part of my video, but yeah, so that's my makeup story. And um, I actually, when I was sitting down, and I was like, even as I start this, um, what do I want to have as my first first videos? And I decided I'd actually share this journey of mine of makeup. Um, I decided I'll actually share my journey of makeup with you guys. So yeah. For example, right now what right now what is 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 giving me a lot of um work and is putting on eyelashes. I know it's not a must. I really don't do them every time, but I'm practicing. So when I feel like I want to wear them, I'll just wake up, do my makeup nicely and put them on and just try to put them on and keep on watching things that are gonna teach you how to do it, yeah. So like right now i know i'm not really perfect at them but or oh, they're not looking as perfect as someone else's but you know one day you get there yeah we all don't get there at the same time everyone has their own pace of time of getting there yeah so yeah for me so for people out there who really really love makeup and they are really trying to put it on and wondering how does this one do that how does my advice for you is one watch your videos practice slowly by slowly and you're gonna learn you know and if you believe in yourself if you believe i really want to learn this thing you will do it you'll do it girl you're gonna do it and you're gonna win it don't worry you're gonna do it and you're gonna win it okay um hmm. i think i have actually um covered everything that i wanted to talk about in this video I think I have actually just talked about everything that I want to talk about today in this video. As I said, it's just gonna be a short video of me just talking about my makeup and um, just encouraging someone out there that don't worry, you can do it. You know, you can, you can do it. You don't. It doesn't have to be. I don't know how to say. It doesn't have to be a one thing. You know, like pack. You already know how to do everything. No. It, it comes slowly and patience is a virtue, guys. Yeah, patience is a virtue. That is what I'm always telling you, yeah? So thank you guys for watching. I hope um, I've been able to inspire someone about their makeup and to believe, to inspire someone to believe in themselves that they are going to do it. Um, and I hope to grow with you guys. I hope to be doing um, makeup looks for you guys. And uh, yeah. And um, I hope to get your support. So, um, guys, don't forget subscribe if you like the video. Kindly subscribe on the red button. And yes, I'll see you in my next video. Bye bye.